वेलकम बैक एवरी वन नो मेजोरिटी ऑफ द विंडोज यूजर्स आर स्विचिंग टू विंडोज इलेवन अपग्रेडिंग फ्रॉम अ प्रीवियस वर्जन और सेटिंग अप अ न्यू ब्रांड मशीन बट देर आर सम क्लेवर ट्रेक्स टू मेक द प्रोसेस स्मूद एंड द एंड रिजल्ट मोर बेटर सो बकल अप एंड गेट रेडी टू ट्राई दिस बेस्ट ट्रेक वाइल इंस्टॉलिंग विंडोज इलेवन तो वाइल इंस्टॉलिंग विंडोज इलेवन द वेरी फर्स्ट स्क्रीन दैट यू विल बी गेटिंग लाइक दिस नो वेरी टास्क यू लैंग्वेज टू इंस्टॉल टाइम इन करेंसी फॉर मैट and here only we will be applying the first trick that will be helping you to debloat many kind of unwanted software from your windows 11 with the time in currency format it will be by default selected to english united states so you will have to click on the drop down and instead of any particular location you will have to select english world so look for english world here and select it So now what will happen that the windows will be getting confused that what kind of software they should install for this particular location as there is not any kind of decided application or software for the world location i will be showing you by the end of this video so simply click english word then you will have to click on next click on install now select i don't have a product key okay now the next screen that you will be getting it says select the operating system you want to install and it will be displaying you all the different version of windows 11 like home education and pro now here we will be applying the second trick and what you need to keep in your mind that if you are switching from windows 10 to windows 11 and you want that your key should be activated on windows 11 as well then you will have to choose here the same addition that you are using on your windows 10 So let's say if you are using the home edition on your Windows 10 then here also you will have to select the Windows 11 home version if you want that your key should be activated on Windows 11 as well as i have seen many people make the mistake that they were using the home edition on Windows 10 and now while installing Windows 11 they choose the Windows 11 pro version all right so that what you don't have to do in case if you want your product key to be activated okay so choose the same edition then you will have to click on next and now the windows 11 installation will be started and after this we will be applying the third and the last trick that will be very useful for the people who don't want any kind of microsoft account while configuring and installing windows 11 uh, this is a very common problem for majority of the people who don't want to go with a microsoft account but they don't find any kind of option to bypass it so that what i would be explaining that how you can easily bypass a microsoft account and you can switch to a local account Now while configuring Windows 11 you might be getting this kind of a screen that says something went wrong so you don't have to get panic here because we selected the English world location and this is the reason it got confused all right so don't worry just click on skip choose the keyboard layout skip the second layout if you want it then you can have it and now you have to name your device so I will name it as crown then you will have to click on next And now finally you will be coming to this page that says unlock your Microsoft experience and you don't have any other option to bypass it. So when you click on sign in, so you can see that it's asking me for the Microsoft account and if I don't have any account it says me create one, but there is not any option to go and bypass this one and create a local account. So now here the trick is that you have to type any kind of wrong uh Hotmail account over here. So type anything like prime at hotmail.com then you will have to click on next now it will ask you the password so again type any kind of wrong password because you don't have any email account so type any password here then click on sign in all right so now the next screen that you will be getting it says oops something went wrong so this time when you click on next it will automatically give you an option to create a local account right so very simply you have successfully bypassed a microsoft account and now here you can type the desired local account name so again i will type some name for my local account then i will click on next if you want a password for your local account you can type it i will skip for now then i will click on next bingo so now you can see that we successfully bypassed the microsoft account and that was our third and the last trick while installing windows 11 so now you can go and click on next next and accept and continue installing windows 11
okay so finally guys you can see that windows 11 has been installed and now if you see the magic here that when i click on the start icon you will not find any kind of bloatware over here and it seems like neat and clean interface so all the unwanted bloatware that get installed while installing windows 11 they all are being removed now that is just because we selected the world location while choosing the time and currency format so you automatically debloated the windows 11 softwares and applications but still there are some changes that you will have to do like again make a right click on the windows icon click on settings in the left hand menu option you will have to click on time and language click on language and region and here in the country or region now you can switch to from world to english united states or whichever location you want to select all right so now you're all done and that's all guys for today hopefully you found all these tricks useful while installing windows 11 as it will be helping you uh, to get more useful features and debloating many kind of application and if you found this video helpful do not forget to like and subscribe and i see you in the next video bye bye